As we take a look at some of the highlights, Dito sa ating laro. In the first quarter, it was actually a global port quarter. Slow start. Dahil nakita natin, agad-agad umatake si Alex Maliari ng star hotshots. Pero yung outside shooting, as Alex Maliari again stretches and scores. It was a 12 to 6 advantage. Pero kita mo, agad humabol yung global port. Marcus Blakely with a hammer. And when you have the hammer, you put it down. That's correct. Quarter actually, quarter number two, quarter number three. Two actually hot shots, star hot shots ang nanalo doon. Only to have a very big fourth quarter. Um, uh, itong global fourth. So, alam mo naman itong very gritty yan eh. Itong pure food hot shot team. I keep on calling them pure food to get there. And star hot shot, star margarin sila. Also looking very good, but in the end, it was just uh, no, talaga, it was a global port. As we look at uh, your second quarter slowly. And the we second would, quarter, oh, go ahead. Uh, Jolly, we talked about the bench oh. and the transition game. Oh, the beautiful star hot shots that got them into the driver's seat and stay there in the first half. I see some very nice contributions to PJ Simon. You got, of course, your. Uh, King James, James Yap, no? Yung nga uh, na-mention natin, yung magandang layup niya na pipit eh. Yung favorite niya, one-hand uh, layup of uh, James Yap. I'm sure ipapakita din yan come third quarter. And you take a look at Terrence Romeo. Ayang pasayawin, paindakin, at paiyakin ng depensa. With this drive, but that time the takeaway by Marcus Blakely and doing what he does best, he will soar and score. Well, if uh, Hot Shots went on to win that ball game, he would be... Uh, one, my number one candidate para dito sa best player, no? Kitang kita, evident itong si uh, Marcus Blakey. Napaganda ng ginagawa. Pero ito yung mga exciting boys, eh. Omar Graham, two against one. Pringle says, ikaw na mag-finish yan. Very nice left-handed layup para kay Omar Graham that time. And Omar Graham definitely an uh, X-factor para dito sa Global Port Patang Pier. Nakita natin kanyang outside shooting. And then in the fourth quarter, dito nakita natin uh, the star hot shots. Nakuha ulit yung lamang, but Omar Krayam all the way from Ross Boulevard putting it away. That was about 40 feet. No, I said you. That was about 35 feet away from the three-point line. Omar Krayam, grabe ang range ito si Omar Krayam, partner. And yung outside shooting niya, nagbigay uh, ng kalamang sa Global Port, 89 to 87. And then Stanley Pringle with a dagger in the heart of the Star Hotshots. Uh, actually, the uh, Star Hotshots had a chance. Pero yung, uh, this is a nice follow-up of Marcus Blakely off the uh, Mark Baroka miss. Pero yung uh, nag outside na play, yung, uh, uh, this play right here, we couldn't really tell kung saan mapupunta ang ball. Uh, parang yun nga, parang may fingertips. Si Mark Baroka on the ball. That time, we reviewed it several times. 50-50, very tough to call. Pati ako, hindi ko alam partner kung kanina ball. Kaya ganyan ang magiging reaction ng isang coach team ko. And that was a huge play because ultimately, it decided the outcome. Marating sa Global Port Patang, pero they take it 91-89. to What a character win para sa Global Port. Their first also 3-0 start. Well, you know, franchises. When we were listening to Coach Pidu Jarencho kanina, partner, this is not, he's saying this is not their final import. It was Steve Thomas. Pero who knows, partner, if he, they can, they will be able to string up a bunch of wins na siyang import nila, maka may chance na hindi napapalitan itong si Steve Thomas.